Hey guys, today uh, we got a quick video. I'm going to be opening a, a package. Uh, this is one of two things. I kind of forget what it could be. Um, yeah, I've been ordering a lot of games, uh, a lot of Pokemon games. So let's let's open this up and uh, let's see what what it is. Just broke the seal. Here's uh, another envelope. Interesting. What's it going to be? Pokemon Emerald. Let's take a look and see. Uh, let's see what condition it's in. And let's see if it's legitimate or not. If it's, I want to make sure this is not a hack. I'm going to get a little bit closer here. Okay, so the sticker on the front is very used. It looks as though it's gotten wet and um, maybe some of that paper, or that holographic foil has worn off. Um, that's, that's fine though, as long as the game still works. Um, it, there's also a crack right at the front, right there, um, right there in the middle, there's a crack, uh, it shouldn't, you know, it's not moving or anything, none of the pieces are loose. Let's, uh, let's see, so, from the looks of it, there is, there is this little chip, uh, right here on the back, I'm gonna try to point to it with the knife. Uh, it's like a holo right there, right there. This holographic piece, or not holographic, but this reflective piece right here. Um, as far as I know, that indicates that this game is legitimate and not uh, an emulation or some sort of hacked game. Um, yeah, that looks great. Uh, I'm gonna play it on. Uh, I'm gonna play it on this game. Oh, you know what? This uh, the system doesn't have batteries, so uh, let's try it on the old SP. A little bit of a corruption there. Take it out. Put it back in. All right. Ooh, this looks like a Nuzlocke. I wasn't actually going to do this on camera, but this might, this actually might not take that much time. I'm going to spin you around real quick. Let's see if we can do this. Nazlock. Interesting. Is that a, a, maybe someone, maybe that's how you spell it, Nuzlocke in another language. Let's open it up. Zero badges. They must have lost very quick. They're, okay, they're in Rustboro City. That's a cute team. This is like uh, your basic Gen 3 team right here. You got Wingle, Torchic, with a nickname, Gabe, the Pucciana. I love these nicknames. Shroomish, Vessel. Oh, that's actually a great name. Vessel. Vessel, the Ninkata who will evolve and leave behind a, a husk of a corpse. That's pretty cool. I like that name. Vessel and Shushi, the Wimsmer. Shushi. Very cool. I'm like, I, I like this a lot. This is fun. Look at these little guys. That's fun. Maybe, you know what? Maybe I'll continue on this, this, uh, this playthrough and I'll, uh, I'll play through it. I'll honor the, the OT and actually perform a Nuzlocke. We'll see if we'll see if Vessel can make it to the end unscathed. Literally, it needs to be unscathed or it will die. Oh my gosh. Alright, well the game works. That's great. I got a new game. I got a new Emerald version. Um, I, I, actually, I actually like that it's a little scuffed up because that means I can 
I'll be able to tell what the difference is between this copy and my other, I think, two or three copies. You know what? Because you stayed so long. This is what I've amassed in the last month. A little ridiculous. I'm actually proud of it, but a little ridiculous. What happened was I, uh, I wanted to buy a couple games, so I ordered a few off Amazon. I caught the bug, and I, you know the rest. I visited two friends who both offered me all of their games, all their GBA games. So now this will be my third Emerald version. Maybe let's put it right here. Two rubies, two sapphires, three emeralds, 